got a vision, you gotta listen Understand me while I stand up for my opposition I'm content with winning, baby, not just wishing and I Hi, it's Brittany Thank you for joining us once again on Hidden Messages Today I have with me Kobina Thank you for being here, Kobina Appreciate you Kobina, he is a videographer and a musician An all-around talented creator as well and I, I really do appreciate you being here with us. Yeah, I appreciate y'all having me for real. Uh, no problem, but you tired. So, um, as far as the show, you all know that we touch bases on mental health around the community and worldwide. And today, Kobina is here to let us know about a time where he felt like, you know, maybe I need to step back and really think about it because my body is what's important, my health is what's important, and I need to keep myself together and I can get through it. So, Kobina, go ahead, you know, just tell us about a time where you felt like you couldn't talk to someone about it and how you overcame that challenge. Uh, like most of my, like most of the time, I actually had problems. I, I felt like I needed somebody to talk to. Like, I ain't never really call nobody to talk to, you know what I mean? Sometimes I'd rather just sit in like a dark room, right? listen to music, or try to talk to God, because I feel like the people I know got problems already, and then they depend on me for their problems, right. so I don't want to give them my problems, and they're going to throw them off, and then they'll be like, that could be you weak, you know what I mean? Like, you ain't focused, you know what I mean? Like, so with my problems, I put it in my art, like when I'm doing videos, mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I just take all my stress and everything I'm dealing with and just focus, like, yo, this is what I got to do. You know what I mean? But then the moment I get done, I got to come back to my problems. Like, I need another work so I can just keep free. You know what I mean? That's how I free myself through my art. So that's what I really, that's how I deal with my mental problems through art and God. And that's, and that's a natural thing to feel that way because I do, you know, I'm, I try to be there for my friends, especially um, ones that I know that don't usually speak up. So I feel like if they're coming to me about something, something must be wrong and I need True. to listen. Because at the end of the day, a lot of times you might be the last person that this person feels like they have hope in. And if you shut them out or just feel like you're too important to just listen, which is what a lot of people need, is just someone to listen, mm -hmm. then that could be their last straw. You just never know and you just never know what someone is going through. And I do understand about, you know, going home and just, you know, probably sitting in a dark room and just wanting to be by yourself because you feel like once you get out there into the world and everything, you you kind of have to put on this face to to make sure everything is okay because everybody else around you is falling apart. True. So that's truly understandable. And the one thing that I do is talk to God. That's like the number one thing. Nah, that's it. Nah, that's like with some of my learning, you feel me? Like I could talk to him. Uh -huh. Then it's like, all right, like I feel like I'm talking to somebody I ain't right. seen. So I ain't talking to so I feel like I'm talking. I'm like talking to myself is like talking to God. That's how I feel. And that's the whole purpose of being able to do that because mm -hmm. if you don't feel like you can talk to God, it may not be someone physically there, but he's listening. Yeah, and so he's it's always the listening. And it out there and stuff. They just keep moving. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's how I deal with my little stuff. Like, I don't tell nobody. If I tell people, I'll be like, they'll be like, damn, you can help us. I'll be like, nah, I can't. Nah, I don't need your help. You know right. what I mean? Let's let me help you get you. I need to get you. Do what I gotta do because at the end of the day, that's what I do it for. Now, mm -hmm. so I don't want more problems than nobody. Your problem, my problem. Right. Yeah. And and I mean, sometimes unfortunately, that can that can be you know pros and cons. I guess it just depends on who I'm talking to. But the number one person I feel like I can talk to is God. Mm -hmm. And um, I think one of my worst habits is not being able to truly feel like I can talk to people. And it's some people, they're just waiting for someone to come to them to kind of open sign? up. Hmm? What's your sign? A Capricorn. Yeah, I'm a Capricorn. Oh. So, so that's true. <laughs> so that's how I be. Like, yeah, Capricorns, <laughs> we just, you know, we kind of shut down. We, You know, we kind of, and I know a lot of people don't really believe in, you know, zodiac signs and stuff like that. But I truly be other Capricorns that are exactly like me. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it can be frustrating that they're just like me. And sometimes it can be relieving because I'm not the only one that feels that way. Or I'm not the only one that thought that, you know, this only, for the, whatever reason, this only happens to me. So, um, I mean, yeah, I truly do understand that, you know, shutting down, not talking to somebody. But talking to God is one of the best ways to me to be able to overcome whatever I feel like I'm going through. 
it's it's one of the best things I feel like that is needed because I can't I can't even start my day without prayer True. and just meditation and I feel like prayer if I don't pray I feel like you know um you know my day is just not yeah, gonna go yeah yeah and some people you know they're going through their their little spits through life and everything and they feel like what am I gonna do what am I supposed to do and a lot of times all you need to do is just talk to God. Uh, that's it. Listen yeah. to some music. Yeah. Uh, and I mean, if that's if that's how you know how to heal and if that actually works for you to heal, then I feel like that's one of the best methods you can tell someone. And not everyone feels like that's a, a coping mechanism, but it works. And no, no, it helps. Yeah, it, it, it really does help. And I really appreciate you sharing that with us. Even reading helps. Yeah, it keeps your mind clear and stuff. And and I and I like for people to take advice from different people that I interview as far as what they do, because no method is greater than the other. Mm -hmm. And as long as there is a method, I feel like that's something that would work and that's something that would help. And another thing is being able to have people around you that you can pray with as well. Because I feel like if you don't have that, you don't really have a solid enough foundation mm -hmm. to feel like you can take them with you to the next level. So um, I, I really do appreciate you sharing that with us. Yeah. And um, you can kind of let them know as far as what you do with the music and where to find you at and everything. All right, they can find me on Instagram at O official K O B E N A or P F O M K O B E N A. Okay. Cool. No, I mean, it's two different Instagram, one for the music and one for the video. Okay. Just to cool. keep it separated. I don't know if those coming out. Right. <laughs> and you guys can also hit him up. You know, if you need videos done, if you need any type of videography work done, you can hit him up. He's dope. I can vouch for him. I've actually been in one of his videos and it was dope. It turned out perfectly. And also, as far as his work with ethic, it's it's bomb. It's really good. So thank you so much for coming no, here with us today. Y and and you know, for our community, we really got to stick together, y'all. We really have to be able to. If you can't talk to someone physically, talk to God. That's the best thing I can say. Just talk to God. Let him know what's going on. You may not get a answer that you can hear, but you'll always get an answer that you need. Thank you so much for joining us today on Hidden Messages, and I hope you join us next time. I will lie he, but I'm not so mildly. In this house, all you see is Scarface and Ali. Where life push like dollies. I need nights and follies. Live like sheep in UAE. Ain't it right, Khalid? We used to walk through the high end. Buckets on the diet. Born this like Charlotte. High as the Burj Khalifa. High as Wiz Khalifa. Flexing like Batista. We them boys the better FIFA. Accept that shit like Visa. I will